On the final day of a four-day visit to Somalia, UN Under Secretary General Atul Kare pledged the United Nations Support Office in Somalia will do everything in its power to ensure that the Somali security forces take full control of security responsibilities as Africa Union peacekeepers gradually withdraw. Under Secretary General Kare emphasized that in order for the AU and the UN to achieve a successful transition, Somali security forces must take full control over security responsibilities from the Africa Union Transition Mission in Somalia, gradually withdraw with the assistance of the United Nations Support Office. On Sunday, Kare traveled to Dusamare, the capital of Galmudik state, where he met with Somalia's President Hassan Shah Mahmoud and other senior officials. The discussion centered on the ongoing military offensives against the Al Shabaab militants, the withdrawal of the Atmis troops, and the United Nations Support Office assistance in the post Atmis Somalia. Kare visited Dusamareb Airport Forward Operating Base while in Galmudik, which has been designated to hand over in the second phase of Atmis troop drawdown as mandated by the UN Security Council Resolution 2687 2023. The exercise which involves the withdrawal of 3,000 troops, is scheduled to end by the end of this month. He expressed satisfaction with the progress made in establishing and strengthening institutions that will be in charge of securing Somalia after Atmis departs. Other United Nations dignitaries who met with Under Secretary General Kare include Katriona Lane, the UN Special Representative for Somalia, and the head of the United Nations Assistance Mission in Somalia, Anita Kiki Gebo, the UN Deputy Special Representative for Somalia, and George Conway, the UN Deputy Special Representative and Resident and Humanitarian Coordinator for Somalia. The highest ranking United Nations official also met with Atmis Top Management ambassadors from the two contributing countries in Somalia. The highest ranking United Nations official also met with Atmis Top Management ambassadors from two contributing countries in Somalia, representatives from the international community and the United Nations country teams, among others. Diplomats from Kenya, Uganda, Ethiopia, the United Kingdom, Turkey, the United States, the African Union, and the European Union, among others, met with the Under-Secretary General Kare.